This is Fact Depart Present Top 10 Facts Are Very Bad Things You Can Do For Your Body Oversleeping or Hitting the Snooze Button When it comes to sleep, the sweet spot is 7 to 9 hours. Sleeping for fewer than 6 hours or more than 10 hours each night has been linked to chronic diseases, including heart disease, diabetes and obesity, according to a study from the CDC. Throwing Back More Than Two Drinks A Day the CDC has reported that men who drink three to four alcoholic drinks each day are at a higher risk of developing cancer of the mouth, neck and throat. They are also twice as likely to develop liver cirrhosis and high blood pressure. Allow yourself at least two alcohol-free days each week. Watching Netflix Marathons a full evening of orange is the new black may seem like the optimal way to unwind after work, but watch more than three episodes after sitting at your desk for eight hours and you'll put your health in danger. Hiding out indoors. Not getting enough sunlight can deplete your body's vitamin D supply, which happens quickly during cold winter months. Some symptoms of vitamin D deficiency include tiredness, aches and pains, and depression. Smoking socially. According to a recent study from Australia's Sachs Institute, even light smokers double their risk of early death. Overdraining. David Neiman, PhD, a health and exercise science specialist in Boone, North Carolina, has found that 90 minutes or more of continuous, moderate to high intensity, exercise weakens the immune system, making you more prone to illness. This effect can last up to 72 hours. Wearing the wrong shoes. A bad pair of shoes doesn't just lead to foot pain, it can also cause problems throughout your body, your feet are the foundation of your body, and if they are not properly supported you can have problems anywhere from the bottom of your feet up through your neck. Not drinking enough water. Water keeps you hydrated, helps transport oxygen through your body, removes waste and toxins protects your organs, and the list goes on. Not using condoms. Even if your new girl's on the pill, use protection anyway, because pregnancy's not your only concern. The CDC reports that between 2008 and 2012 the chlamydia rate among men increased by 25%, while gonorrhea shot up 4% between 2011 and 2012. Drinking too much coffee. Coffee has its perks, like boosting endurance and delivering a hefty dose of antioxidants, but too much joe can do more than make you jittery. A new published in Mayo Clinic. Proceedings suggests that men who drink more than 28 cups of coffee a week have a 56% higher risk of dying from any cause. Thank you for watching. And. Please subscribe my channel for more videos.